Hi and assalamu alaikum from uh, your boy Shani's world and mama bae we are once again in the kitchen and today mom is going to be making numerous things for you guys um, so what we'll do is we are going to go straight into it we're going to turn the camera we're going to start from the basic uh, item first so mom's going to make uh, the daywali chutney for you we will show you how that's made then we'll move on to the salad and then we'll move on to the other items that mom's going to be making yes. such as the lamb curry uh, the uh, mincemeat and uh, potato uh, and kitchen. Um, and what else are you making? Pakore. pakore so we're going to be making some pakoras as well, mm. uh, and so forth and so on. So let's turn the camera and show you how the chutney is made. And fish as well. Fish as well. Let's not forget the fish. <laughs> and let's turn the camera and show you how it's made. So, okay, guys, here we are. We are going to make the chutney now. So, Mama Be, go for it. Okay. Green chili, mirch that's raw, and milk. Okay, so the next step, now that uh, mom has grinded those ingredients up, is um, to make sure that the yogurt has been whisked um, properly so that it's nice and smooth and then you want to add these ingredients which Mama Bear is about to add So it's got to be nice and smooth as you can see. So there we are guys, the chutney is now ready and it's looking absolutely fantastic. Okay, so what Mama Bear has done now is uh, obviously put a bit of cling film on it uh, and she's going to put that in the fridge. Um, ready to be uh, consumed later on. Right, so Mama Bear is ready to make the salad now and she's going to be adding all these ingredients. We will put them in the description down below. So go for it, Mama Bear. Carrot. So that's all like the carrots, the peppers. Uh, go in. Peppers. So you got green and red peppers. Next up, Mama Bay is going to be adding cucumbers. Yeah, just make sure you chop them nice and fine, like you can see. And that's your muli. And then you've got your lettuce. And then you've got your sweet corn. And your tomatoes. And then you want to add uh, a bit of ground uh, pepper on there. So a nice touch of ground pepper. And then give it a nice good old mix. And then you want to... Yeah, so you want to add uh, a few uh, pudina leaves. Uh, it's nice for the uh, aroma. And you can cut them up and then in little pieces and then you want to squeeze fresh lemon straight on top and once again give it a nice good old mix pepper. and then you can just add a nice little touch of uh, pepper again your salad ready. Mama Bay has done a phenomenal job once again. Well done Mama Bay. And the same with this, put some cling film on top, just like that, to make sure it stays nice and fresh. And then you can stick that straight into the fridge. Perfect. Okay people, now that Mama has made the salad and she has made the chutney for you, we are going to move on to making the 
So we are going to make brown rice, kima, matar, alu, brown rice. Yes, that's what we're going to be making now. So it's uh, basically minced meat. It's got your potatoes and it's uh, kichdi, which is uh, rice, mm -hmm. and it's going to be absolutely amazing. So let's do this. Mom has added the uh, ginger in. Ginger slice. Yeah, so make sure uh, when you add the uh, ginger in, they are cut in nice fine pieces, as you can see. And now let it cook uh, for a while until the onion goes like a nice brown goldy color. Look at this guy, he thinks he's a chef. Look um, at him. That's why I feel like Ramsay, you know. What, you feel like Gordon Ramsay? Yeah, I swear that. <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> now I'm gonna put these bits and bobs in there. Yeah, you don't even know where I to don't start, know what mate. Cool, but yeah. <laughs> Look at him. It's looking nice. It's looking nice. Okay, guys, so basically, while the onions are turning into a nice brown colour, um, what we're going to do is the next step is to grind all these ingredients you see uh, in front of you. Mama Bear is going to grind them up for you right now. So just like that. Guys, now that uh, all those ingredients have been grinded together, you want to uh, put them straight into the pan alongside your onions and your uh, ginger. Right, now that all that's ready, mom's nicely washed uh, the mince meat, so it's all ready to be put in the pan. So mama bear is going to stick it right in. And then give it a, and then give it a nice uh, stir like mama bear has. Is you want to cook this up uh, for 10 to 15 minutes on full heat until all the water evaporates. Mom's going to lift the lid off. And the keema is looking absolutely phenomenal. And now you just want to give it a nice stir, make sure all the water evaporates like uh, we said earlier. So the uh, minced meat is now ready. So what mom's going to do is she's going to put some uh, potatoes in, which she uh, chopped up earlier. And then for two minutes, just give it a good old stir, let them cook for a while. And then after two minutes, you want to add all the uh, green peas in. And now what you want to do is stick the lid on and again for about two to three minutes let it cook on full heat. Okay so guys your next step is to add some water. So lift the lid off. Okay so now what you want to add is uh, boiling water. You do not add cold water in guys. Make sure you add boiling water straight from the kettle if you want to. Okay, and then for two minutes, let it cook with the lid on. 
and then after those two minutes you will be adding the next item in now that two minutes are gone your next step is to remove the lid and add in the white rice which mama bear has uh, pre-washed and it's all ready just to add into the pan and then let it cook on full heat guys until the water evaporates Okay, the water is uh, dried up wow. as you can see. And now you're going to put it on dam, which means uh, you're going to cook it further. For how long, Mum? Okay, so cook it like that, the way Mum has uh, put the cloth on, uh, for about two to three minutes. Full heat. Full heat. And then straight after. Bilkul halki heat. Then you want to put Small. it on low heat mm. and then cook it for 20 minutes. Right, so cooker it's time to do the reveal. Which, so switch the cooker off. And now and it's ready. Oh yes. Ta-da! Look at that. <laughs> Fantastic. Mashallah, that looks beautiful. Mashallah, it looks absolutely amazing, right oh. Pops? That, um, it's absolutely delicious, I can tell. Oh yes. Just by looking at it. <laughs> And now I'm hungry, ready to eat. Yes. Okay, so what mom's gonna do is just mix it up a bit, Halka just like that, just really lightly. As you can see in the video. And then take it straight into the um, oh, plate. Look at this. Splendid. Oh yes. Brown rice. Well done, Mama Bear. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes. Ajo sab garam garam khao. There we are. Ajo sare garam garam khao. Yeah. Look at that, people. That looks absolutely delicious. Mind blowing. Acha ji, Begum ji, bohot shandar banaya. Thank you. Bohot umda. Next dish. Gosh. There we are. Gosh. So now it's the karai gosh. I've been waiting for the karai gosh. Oh yes. yes. I think I am as well. Yes. It's absolutely amazing the way mom makes it. Viewers, keep watching. Let's, keep watching. Let's go to the next step, karai gosh. Okay guys, now that uh, we've brown made rice. the brown rice and it looks absolutely amazing as you saw in the footage. Uh, next, Mama Bear is going to prepare some lamb karai. Lamb karai. Yes, so that's the next uh, item that Mama's going to be making. So let's turn the camera once again and show you how lamb karai is made. Let's do this. So basically what you want to do is you want to put, uh, you know, you want to make sure the uh, meat is nicely washed. Uh, and put in the uh, pan paani ja with paake. a bit of water ek chamchi bas na eh ji ek chamchi and put one tablespoon of salt in there hmm. now what you want to do is cook it for about uh, an hour hour and a half on medium heat hmm. until the meat goes nice and soft, soft. and tender yeah. so stick that lid on and let it cook <laughs> Okay, the lamb is now ready. So what we're going to do is we're going to add these ingredients to make uh, the masala. Stick uh, the garlic and ginger in as well. Light brown only. And then you want to cook it just for a while until uh, it goes a light brown colour. Right, the onion is now nice uh, and light garlic brown. And onion, light brown. So it's got like a, a nice golden colour and you want to add the tomatoes in next.
And then you want to add the rest of the ingredients. Masale, sorry. So all the masala powders. Once again, everything will be in the description down below. So make sure to check it out. Okay, now green you want to add uh, the green chilies. Which uh, mom grinded over. Okay, the last part is tomato. And then add some water in, a glass of water. Stir it up. Put the lid on. And then stick the lid on and let it cook for a while. Five minutes. For about five minutes. Right, guys, the masala is ready. As you can see. And then you want to add the yogurt in. And then for another five minutes, put the lid on and let it cook. Hey, masala is finally ready. So uh, the, the lamb that you uh, cooked earlier, yeah, it's nice and soft and tender now. So you can add that to the masala. And now just squeeze a fresh lemon. Lemon. With some uh, fresh coriander. And one teaspoon garam masala. And one teaspoon garam masala. Now that that's ready for another five minutes, people. Light heat, we cook. On a very light heat, you want to cook it for about five minutes. And voila, the boneless lamb curry is ready. It's going to be transferred into a, uh, a bowl. Wow, 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 wow. Ah, Papa Bear is already here. Yeah, because the lamb curry is now ready. I think you smelt the aroma. As soon as you smelt it, you came running. I've been sitting, <laughs> waiting patiently. And Mrs. Begum has done a good job, inshallah. She has, honestly. And I hope you viewers have enjoyed it. This girl has put a lot of effort in. Oh, just yes. For you Mama Bear puts the effort in daily. So we want a lot of likes, yes. a lot of thumbs up. Hit those thumbs up, guys. Well Very done, nice. Mama Bear. There we are guys, there's your lamb curry and I've got to say, mashallah, it looks absolutely fantastic, perfect. Well, the salad is done, the, uh, chutney. the chutney is done, obviously the rice is done, the rice is done. Uh, the lamb the curry is and the lamb curry is done. Next up, what we got mom? Pakore. Now it's the pakora time. So. We are going to turn the camera around as usual and we're going to show you how the pakoras are made. Let's go. Okay guys, so mom's going to start making the uh, pakora mixture. So you got vesan and uh, you've got salt and a few other spices that uh, needs to be added. So after um, adding all those ingredients, as you can see in the video, uh, you want to give it a nice good old mix. So you got your potatoes, 
लंबे लंबे कटने नहीं ना कहीं। Yes, mums uh, cut them up. Slices. Yes, so uh, thin slices. Palak. Then you got spinach. And tania. And you got coriander. मैं थोड़ा थोड़ा पानी पा के ना तो बर्फ And then that's it. Stick uh, some water in, but you don't want to add uh, all the water all at once. You want to just uh, add uh, little little portions of water and then mix it up. Just like that. We have some thoda pai da the material zyada. So you put less uh, of the um, flour, the gram flour and you put more of the uh, ingredients that you can see such as coriander, the spinach, the potatoes, etc etc. Okay guys so the um, pakora mixture is now ready so we will uh, show you how it looks it's looking absolutely amazing so once again well done to mama bear and the next step is going to be frying these pakore and then they will be uh, ready to uh, consume so that's it there guys that's the uh, pakora mixture yeah, and it looks fantastic mm. perfect So there we are guys that's the pakoras going straight in And trust me they're going to look magnificent once once they're ready Thode thode basai chukki jani de pai jani So yeah just like mom is doing just pick up little little uh, chunks of them and put them straight into the oil and let them fry up As you can see you can put quite a few of them in uh, all at once. And what you want to uh, keep in mind guys is to keep frying them and keep them in the oil until they turn into a nice brown color. Like a medium brown. Hey, you're doing a fantastic job. <laughs> <laughs> yes, so we've still got the fish to make as well, guys. Remember that. Masala mm, fish. But let's continue with the pakora making. So there we are, guys. They are now ready to be taken out the oil. Crunchy, but any crunchy. And they're nice and crunchy, and they look absolutely amazing. So Mama Bear is gonna be taking them out now. Amazing pakoras. Beautiful. Beautiful. Crunchy Oh yes. Now that all them items are done, the pakore are made as well. Yes. The next one, what are we doing, Mama? So basically, these are massive like green uh, chilies. Mm. So pass me one, Mom, just so that I can show you guys. You got two different types. You got this one here and small one. Yeah. And then you've got the slightly smaller ones, which is these ones here. So mom is going to So she's kind of cut them in half, but uh, she's going to fill them up with some uh, mixture, mm. some masala and stuff, and then we're going to show you when they're fried up. So let's do this. Okay, guys. So here we are. Namak, miras, the motiya mircha. So mama bear's got the uh, spices and stuff. And uh, like I told you uh, previously, everything will be in the description, guys, uh, for those that want to know what's gone into them. Onion. 
So there we are guys, the mixture is now ready. So we're gonna uh, transfer it where the oil is so that we can fry these spices up. Right, so a bit of oil in the pan guys and then you wanna put the cumin seeds. And then you wanna put that mixture you just made into the pan. Two, three and then minutes. cook it up uh, for about two to three minutes. Right, so that what mum has done is took it out the pan again and put it straight in the bowl just like that to uh, cool down. And once it cools down, you're going to start Yes, perfect. Okay guys, uh, the uh, mixture has cooled down now. So uh, mama bear is going to start filling these spices. So yeah, just using your hands, just uh, open it up and uh, fill it in. Stuff it with the mixture. So just like that guys, the chorti it up. Yeah. Uh, small one Perfect. Good job mama bear. Okay guys, so as you can see, the spices have now been filled in. So what we're gonna do is put these to one side and we are gonna fill some aubergine up as well. So we're gonna do the same thing. So we're gonna wash it and then uh, slice it up. So as you can see in the video guys, uh, this is how you want to slice them up. And then you want to make uh, That's it. So uh, put some uh, little cuts in it. Just like you can see in the video. And now stick them in the tray. Perfect. Now a bit of lemon water, straight on top. Then you want to add uh, some uh, salt as well. And with some red chilli powder. And then just uh, rub it down, as you can see. Make sure the spice goes all over. And you can and then do the exact same thing on the other side. Ah, nice. Now we're going to make the mixture. So, mama bit, go for it. Yes, yeah, so all these uh, dry uh, spices are going to go straight in with the gram flour. And then you want to add uh, the rest of the ingredients. And once again, all this will be in the description, guys. And like you did with the pakoras, you want to just add little little bits of water, not too much, but just a little amount at a time whilst mixing. So there we are guys, all three items are now ready. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take it where the oil is and we're gonna fry them up for you. So let's go. So 
So just like that people, what you want to do is make sure the mixture goes all over the spice. The way Mama Bear is doing it. Like this. And there we are guys, the spices are now ready and yeah, mom's gonna transfer them. Light brown but they are not light. Yeah, so make sure they're like a nice light brown. Ah. So there we are. Mama Bear's gonna transfer them into the plate. They are it. Yes. So it's a mixture of uh, the big spices and the little ones. Yeah. Oh yes. Well done, Mom. Okay, just like that. Uh, yes. Yeah. Yes. So again, stick them in the uh, masala, the mixture. Straight into the uh, pan. Bubbly jar. Bubbly jar. Bubbly jar. Bubbly jar. Bubbly jar. Bubbly and there we are people they are ready now as well oh yes so let me just zoom in mama bear let me just uh, show the viewers Mm. Look at that oh, people. Nice oh yes. Fantastic. And last but not least, it is time to fry up some fish. So the next step is mom's gonna prepare some amazing fish. Lahori fish masala. Yes, masala, so, fish. masala fish sort of thing. So it's a Lahori uh, masala fish. And uh, I'm telling easy you now, the it's very easy to make mm. and it's so delicious. You've got to try it. Mm. Okay, so Mama Bear. Okay. okay, so what Mama Bear is saying, obviously while you're making the fish, uh, it takes uh, quite a bit of garlic, so you've got to put uh, extra garlic in. Mm -hmm. Everything will be in the description, like I said before. So these are the ingredients that are going to be put in. Yes, so there we are, those are the items. There's your fish. She's washed, washed it. Yeah. So there you go. So Mama Bear has washed it and dried the fish. Put it in a bowl, ready to prepare with these ingredients. So Mama Bear normally grinds all of this. Without using a grinder, she just does it herself. Those phone are the palo, Joan. Tea phone. Two teaspoon Namak, but Namak Mirch up the Asizra Zada Mirch Kane. Taste the thin Chamas Do Add the koji, add chatu, add vata. Add chatu, the ass are the vata. Add the masada machinum madavangaji. Chaloji, chaloji. Banaoge. Chaloji. I mean, treat. Papa Bear is going to be making uh, the masala, as you can see. Can you sing chatu vata? Chatu vata. I'm going to ask you to ask you to ask you to ask you to ask <laughs> it is, it is. Papa Bear is putting some effort in. Papa Bear is slowing down. Are you not used to it, Dad? Are you not used to doing it? <laughs> okay, for the fish, now that the masala is ready, you want to put it straight into the bowl, like Mama Bear has. 
ਤੇ ਥੋੜੀ ਜਿਹੀ ਵਿੱਚ ਹਲਦੀ ਪਾਉ ਹਾਫ ਟੀਸਪੂਨ ਐਂਡ ਦੈਨ ਐਡ ਅ ਬਿਟ ਆਫ ਟਰਮਰਿਕ ਪਾਊਡਰ ਤੇ ਉਹ ਚੰਗੀ ਤਰ੍ਹਾਂ ਮਿਕਸ ਕਰ ਲਓ ਐਂਡ ਮਿਕਸ ਇਟ ਅਪ ਜਸਟ ਲਾਈਕ ਦਾ ਮੱਛੀ ਦੇ ਉੱਤੇ ਸਾਰਾ ਮੇਕ ਸ਼ੂਰ ਦਾ ਮਸਾਲਾ ਗੋਸ ਆਲ ਓਵਰ ਦੀ ਫਿਸ਼ do guys is uh, now that the masala is on the fish you want to keep it for half an hour ha fair tal ni yes and then they will be ready to uh, fry, fry up yeah. so just put it to one side for half an hour is i think this is the last 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 thing that masala. mama bear is going to be making the masala is on and you want to stick it straight into the oil just like that oh yes Okay guys the fish is ready as well and mama bear once again is going to take it out of the oil and place it into the plate There we are so the masala fish is ready now as well so let's zoom in and show you guys how it's looking oh yes acha main ek kehna si ke This masala fish is my favorite. Okay. And mashallah she's done an excellent job here. Like always. I'm actually <laughs> satisfied and my mouth is watering. Mm -hmm. And these two are standing on my right. Uh what was the name again? Uh Fufu and Bibi. No, what we call them Chattu and Chattu Batta. Chattu and Batta. Ah, Chattu and Batta. Who's the Chattu? Chattu this one. Chattu cuz he's fat Batta. <laughs> चलो चट्टू बटे चलो खाना खाओ बाहर जाओ लेट्स फॉलो यू गाइस कम ऑन आओ जी सारे खाओ जी आ जाओ सब रोटी खाओ आ जाओ सारे खा लो एंड बटा ओवर देयर इज डांसिंग लाइक ऑलवेज बट ही इज हंग्री एज़ वेल आई थिंक वी ऑल आर सो ये व्हाट वी आर गोना से इज मामा बे हैज डन अ फेनोमेनल जॉब एज यूजुअल व्हाट आर दीस हियर आर जस्ट मेड टू परफेक्शन आई थिंक परफेक्ट अम माशाल्लाह शी इज डन अ गुड जॉब देयर um uh, obviously she's explained all this here yep and these are very tasty in mm -hmm. fact so i would encourage those people who haven't yet tried these give it a go give it a go honestly you will absolutely um devour them you love them. them so that's a speciality i think okay. right time to reveal. i want you to start revealing and give that a spin okay. once you've revealed it okay so so let's open them up the naan yeah Let's reveal the the kitty. brown rice, yeah. Brown rice. Brown yeah. rice. Let's reveal pakore. Pakore. Vegetable pakore. Yeah. And also the lamb curry. Lamb curry. Now I'm going to go closer and you're going to give it a nice little spin for the viewers to have a look. There we are. Look at that. Mashallah, like that's very nice. It is. It is. Bravo, Perfect. bravo. Mm. Okay guys, make sure you give this uh, a go. I hope you enjoyed everything that Mama Bear made for you guys. Um we are going to continue eating now. We're going to let the family <laughs> eat in peace. Um and inshallah I mean we will catch you in the next vlog. Make sure make sure make sure give us a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel if you already haven't done so and uh, comment down below of what you thought of Mama Bear's cooking. So until then it's Allah Hafiz from your boy Shami's world Khuda Hafiz and it's Khuda Hafiz from the full family so god bless Thank take you. care see you soon